Hi, writers. It's Mrs. LaRocca here one more time with you. Um, for this lesson, I think that you are ready to take this out on your own and do it in a way that works best for you. We call this self-selected inquiry. And to do that, you just get to explore the books you're reading and start collecting sentences from those books that you find really interesting sentences that you think can help you as a writer. And so to do that, all you do is um, whenever you're reading, like this is the book I'm reading right now, whenever you're reading, just have your notebook nearby. Woo! This is, this is my notebook. I have all kinds of things inside my notebook. Look at all of this writing and notes that I keep inside of my notebook. And so in here, I have collections of sentences that I have found in books. Like in this book, um, I found a repetitive sentence that um, I thought was interesting because at first it, it stuck out at me because it was repetitive. So it says, sometimes Jamie was annoying. Sometimes she was a mean tease, but sometimes Bat thought she was brilliant. And the reason why it stuck out at me is because it was repetitive. And as a writer, I know that I'm not supposed to be repetitive. So I had to think, well, why did the author choose to be repetitive here? And so that's why I wrote it down, because I wanted to remind myself that I can be repetitive at certain times, when I want to leave an effect on the reader. And so that's something that I collected. So that's something that you can do. When you're out reading, carry your notebook with you and start collecting sentences that you think you can use in your own writing. And then when you find one, go ahead and write it down. Think about what the author has done and why he or she did that. And then try to imitate it, just like what we've been doing. Try to write your sentence using that same structure. And then try to go beyond that and apply it and add that craft move into your own writing and everything that you do. But whenever you're reading, keep a notebook nearby because you might find something that you want to add to your notebook um, and then turn around and imitate. Have fun with it. Again, if there's something that you want to share with me, send it to your teacher and he or she can send it my way. I would love to see it. And just keep pushing yourself as a writer. And remember that your best writing teachers are inside your books. Have a great day. Take care of yourself.